Hello, bag sellers. Are you selling the same products in multiple stores of multiple marketplaces? It must be not convenient for you to manage the stock by landing on multiple sales centers. Try to push inventory feature in Big Seller to sync your stock to different sales centers. First, go to Inventory section to add Merchandise Queue. You can add Single or Combination as queue. The Merchandise Queue will stand for the same product which is displayed by multiple listings in different stores. Key in the name, title and other related details. Then map store SKU with the merchant SKU. You can filter and search to select store SKU here to do the mapping. Select the listings that you need. A merchant SKU can be mapped with multiple store SKUs. If you cannot buy the needy product, you can try to see products first. You can see that the Merchant SKU and the Store SKU have been mapped together. Save the setting. Then the Merchant SKU has been created. If you need, you can edit the Merchant SKU info again. Next step is to add push route to see the store. Go to the push inventory page. Click to add push rule. Key in the rule name. Select Merchant SKU. You can select multiple Merchant SKUs in the same push rule. You can filter and search for the Merchant SKUs. Click Confirm Then select the warehouses that you have put the merchant SK into You can select just one or multiple warehouses Then select the stores that you want to send the stock to You can choose to set a store threshold when your stock is below the quantity set, the stock of all the selected stores will be updated to zero. To avoid overselling, you can also set a priority store. You can select a store from the stores that you have selected above. And then set a safety stock. When the available stock of a certain merchant SKU is below this quantity, the stock will be updated to zero and only this priority store will have the stock to sell. You can also set push rate to decide the store quantity you need to send to your online stores. Then save the setting. The push rule has been created. Don't forget to turn it on here. If you need, you can also edit the rule again. At last, don't forget to enable the inventory feature in setting section. Go to inventory settings, enable the inventory feature button. You can select when you want the orders to be allocated with stock. With all the steps above, you can sync stock of the same product across different stores of multiple marketplaces. Okay, don't forget to like the video, leave your comments, and subscribe to our channel. Bye bye!